Okay, I'm going to be showing you guys how to jailbreak your iPod with 3.0 software. Um, should see the 3.0 software right here. I have it. If I scroll over, nope, the other way. Got the full 3.0 software. It's free for me. I don't know how. Oh, iPod froze in between there. Okay, yeah. Sometimes iPod gets stuck like that. I don't know why. You see, you notice that mine does say Sprint at the top. Because from my previous jailbreak, I guess that's set and saved or something. But we're going to get all started with it. You should have downloaded my links on the side of it. Um, on the side over there. Uh, after you've done that, you want to install everything, open a zip file, and extract every file that's in there. So you're going to click that, and you're going to hit run. Browse for it. Uh, I'm going to use this one. And the last one I did didn't work. Okay, I'm gonna hit next. All right, now what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna show you how to put the iPod in DMF or DFU. Uh, so, I forgot, did I have it plugged up last time I did it? Um, oh, I'm just gonna ask you: Do you want to install City or IC? You want to hit IC? I mean, City. Keep that checked. Okay. Um, so. Camera, my homemade dock right here. Okay, plug it up. All right, uh, you want to hold the home and the power button. Once you hear it uh, disconnect, let go of the power button. Keep holding the home button. All right, now keep holding the home button. You want to let it go, and it's in DFU mode. Uh, sorry about this, you guys. We have to really do the stand on it, whatever. Um, you want to hit next, and then it's in DFU, so it's rebooting. It, okay, actually, it's going faster than my last time I did it. Okay, rebooting. Everything is going way faster. Okay, then you should see this. It's going way better than it did last time. You get this. It's cool. I wish you guys could save that. That's, that's a cool thing. Um, so, doing that is actually going faster than it did last time. Last time it took like five minutes. And when it rebooted, it didn't reboot correctly. So, let's talk about some of the things. Um, You download my videos. Uh, I do have um, other videos where you can download sources for themes, winter board. I'm currently trying to find summer board. So if anybody knows where that is and where I can download that, that'd be nice if you give me the uh, source. Um, yeah. Uh, so if you want, you can subscribe. You don't have to. I'm not one of people say subscribe to my video if you watch this. Nah, you can do it. But okay, it's reconnecting, and you should see this. Little pineapple, nice little pineapple, but it's the little status bar right there. You see that? Whatever. Oh, I'm gonna discuss discuss something that's really weird to me. I, I did the jailbreak for the other iPod, I mean for the iPod 2.2.1 software yesterday. Um, and then I did, I was, uh, then I upgraded to 3.0 and iTunes said I had it and I didn't know that I had it and it was nowhere on my system because I had to re-download it today. Um, when I re when I upgraded the 3.0 software, it kept all my apps, all my music and all my jailbroken apps that I did not install from Instalus. Um, yeah, <laughs> I did not install it from Instalus. So it had all of those and um, I don't know, that was really weird. It still had all that and it still had the uh, Make It Mine that I used to uh, change the name where it says iPod. It still had that. And that was really weird. I just wanted to point that out. I don't know why I did that, but iPod rebooting. I wish it had the penguin like my 
2.1 software. When I did that, I wish I had that. That was pretty cool. Boot logo. Pretty sure it's still on my system somewhere. Okay. And there goes your jailbroken iPod. Um. Yep. There goes Cydia. I'm gonna take it. I'm gonna drag it. Yep. There goes Cydia. And everything. So I guess <coughs> you guys want me to show some of the things, some sources that I use. So I guess I'll go ahead and do that. Um, what you want to do? You want to open up Cydia. This is going to be the first time you open it, so it's going to have to download a whole bunch of uh, packages and all the other kind of stuff, miscellaneous stuff that it downloads. That it downloads. Try to move that out the light. It's kind of reflecting off the light. Okay. Um, by the way, not to mention if you're watching this video, the new Harry Potter movie comes out on Wednesday, so I recommend that you go see that. If you like Harry Potter, pretty good. I heard that uh, they're going that they show how Dumbledore is gay, so... That's pretty interesting because I always thought he was a straight dude. Alright, now you want to re-click on Cydia. It should open up. Let it load up and everything. I don't know where that little Apple thing came from. No, you don't want to cancel any of this right now. You just want to sit there, wait, let it reload data, reload everything. Oh, another thing I want to mention. Um, some people might tell you that you need to download installer, or you see, you might see other videos. But if you see those videos, I think those videos are only for the 1.1.5 software, and so you're like two softwares above that. So. Yeah, I wouldn't recommend downloading installer because you have Cydia installer, which is on the new 2.0 installer. What you're gonna see, you're gonna see this right here. You're gonna hit, gonna hit. Uh, now you can't see it, but the second one where it says complete upgrade, hit that. You're gonna hit confirm. This should be like a fast. Good, fast, and quick download. That's real weird. I don't know if you can't see it. Uh, no, I don't think you can actually can see it. Maybe if I change the angle that I'm holding the iPod. Still says sprint. I don't know if you guys can make that out, but it says sprint right there. I don't know how that stayed on there. But I'm gonna close it and restart Cydia. And open Cydia back up. It will not open back up by itself. You would think it would do that once it, because it said restart, but it does not open it back up itself. It should be finished loading all things. And what you want to click on is um, more packages. Um, so I'm going to move this on here because I don't have a case. I don't like the back of my iPod getting scratched up. So, you want to download. Uh, you want to click more package sources. Should let that load up. Alright, now one you will download is, um, uh, quick is the poem one. Oh, you want to download this one. So you're going to hit that one. You're going to hit, um, install. And then after you click it up there, you want to hit cancel and queue. And then continue queuing. And then you can go back. You can find, oh, poem center. You need that one. This one right here. You want to get that one. But I'm making another video. So I'm stopping it right here. 